Welcome to Nondrill, a new and innovative Australian-made handrail system. I would now like to show you how quick and easy this system is to install. Firstly, open it about 120mm. At an angle, put the clutch over the anchor, slip it over, into an upright position, screw down. That's her hand tight, and to release it for the exact way. Up to about 120 mil again. And out. Because of how the base connects to the post, ensures its strength, which I will now demonstrate with an excavator. Our original idea for this system was to utilise the lifts and anchors already on RE walls, which now reduced a lot of labour by keeping the back wall clear to complete the concrete works. Clients around Australia are finding multiple uses for this system. Eliminate where possible drilling handrails into concrete structures, which carries the risk of exposing steel by simply placing a recess plug where a handrail is needed prior to the concrete pour. Around vides, as shown here, edge of concrete decks on high rises, in situ stairs, retaining walls. Install the handrail before formwork and edge protection is removed. The same for precast structures. Have precast companies set the recess plug where you require a handrail. We sometimes core drill to drop in a post and fill grout around it, normally for chain wire fencing. You can make it a permanent handrail. Australia's scaffold, as you can see, has many attachments to achieve this. You can eliminate a lot with this system. Safety side of things, the use of power, drill twisting in your hand when you hit steel, labour side of things, drilling, going back patching the holes where you hit steel, grouting holes in the dish drain and RE walls, core drilling, etc. There's also a post to suit the five ton anchor. Many concrete structures that have five ton anchors can be utilised to place handrails, culvert cells, stormwater outlets, tilt panels, and especially jersey barriers to give you a solid handrail on top. We have designed what you call a drop-down post. To connect to RE walls as they get built up, it allows you easily to adjust the handrail as backfilling progresses to maintain that 900 height on top of handrails. I'd now like to show you what's coming uh, soon. Normally for small, medium-sized pours, we use this system here. A Z bar with a reverse nut, conjute, taping up. If we're below ground, we have to excavate more in order to get the Z bar in and out. Now using the same principle as the, as the um, handrail, we simply just set the recess plug and connect the same clutch, which will have a longer treaded bar to tie in your formwork. Visit our website for more information and call us today to see how our new non-drill system can work for you.